In the Monk's Tale, in the Canterbury Tales, Harry Bailey is impressed with Dame Prudence's patience. He then calls on the monk to tell his tale. Now the monk begins by saying he will tell tragic stories of how those of high status were brought low. Lucifer was the brightest of angels, but he sinned and was sent to hell where he remains. Adam lived in Eden until he ate the fruit of the prohibited tree, which caused him to live a life of hard work and misery. Samson was a noble warrior, but his wife convinced him to tell the secret of his strength and betray him to his enemies. Hercules, famous for his many amazing feats of strength, is given a shirt made with poison, which causes his flesh to rot and fall off the bones. The monk continues with a long series of similar stories. The knight cannot take any more, so he interrupts. The knight prefers stories about men who go on to great success instead. Harry Bailey agrees and calls on the nun's priest. The monk's tale is not one story, but many, and stories of moral teachings are known as exemplum. In Chaucer's time, collections of exemplum like this one were common. The monk's goal is to tell stories about people who were prosperous but fell into misery, presented not as heroes, but victims of fortune. Chaucer pokes fun at this genre through the tediousness of the monk's tales, commenting through the pilgrims on what makes good storytelling. This collection of half-baked morality tales cannot compete with well-developed narratives.